Welcome to my channel, Light as a Feather Tarot. This is for the water signs, so this is for Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. This reading will be um, looking at the energies over the next 72 hours, so between Friday and Sunday. Um, I'm also giving away a free reading um, just based on the milestones of subscribers that I've received. Um, if you would like the video subscribe to my channel and comment below hashtag your sign so hashtag cancer hashtag scorpio or hashtag pisces and then um sunday i will announce the winner and the winner will receive a free reading from me um i'll reach out to you and you can pick a free general reading love reading or uh like career money finance so just wanted to do something to say thank you for supporting my channel. So let's look at the energies for over the next 72 hours. What messages do Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces need to know? All right. So we have a timekeeper within the next few weeks. All right, so I'm gonna get a Law of Attraction card. Mm, communication. I effectively communicate and clarify my needs in order to achieve my goals. So communicating, setting goals, success, that is what I'm feeling with that energy. So what do my water signs <clears throat> need to know for the next 72 hours? So at the bottom of the deck, um, you guys are moving forward. You are moving away from anything that does not serve you. You are moving from choppy waters into smoother waters. This could be a physical move. This could be a new way of thinking um, because of the swords. I feel like you're moving towards your satisfaction. You're moving towards your wish fulfillment. You may have you may have had some type of, you know, or will have some type of new beginning, um, new way of thinking. So very, very beautiful energy. All right. So we have the two of cups, the chariot, the eight of cups, ace of cups and the four of wands. So starting off, we're starting off with the Two of Cups. So this speaks about some, some type of soul connection between you and another person. This could be romantic, this could be platonic, um, but there's some type of connection that you have with another person. And then, you know, with communication, I'm feeling like communication is, with the Two of Cups and communication, I feel like there's going to be some type of harmony or some type of connection with this person. So I feel like it's easy to talk to this person. You also have the chariot. So this is about moving forward. You know, this is a forward moving energy. This is a victorious energy. Um, this could speak of physical travel. Um, you have the six of swords for your overall energy. So this is your second card of moving forward. You know, so if things have been a little bit stagnant, um, you're definitely gonna see some type of movement or feel the, the energy moving. Yet another moving forward card. Um, you know, this guy is walking forward. You see his back is towards us. He's moving forward, his back is towards us. You know, I feel like you guys are wanting to move forward. You do have within the next few weeks, so you know, maybe it isn't within the next 72 hours, however, you know, it doesn't mean that the universe and your angels and guides aren't working behind the scenes, making this um, manifestation come come true. And with this eight of cups, this is something you ask for. 
you ask for this movement you ask you know to pack up your things and you know move on for your highest good so you manifested this so very beautiful and you're moving forward into the ace of cups you're moving forward into um, abundance um, overflowing um, of emotional fulfillment so very brand new beginning very beautiful energy you have the king of wands you know this could represent you or someone around you and i'll pull some clarifying cards on this guy and it can be a male or female and you know maybe you guys are focused on your stability focus on your home life focus on your foundation i mean everyone is pretty much stuck at home right now um so maybe that's your focus so spirit what messages do we have for the two of cups Ooh. all right so this flew out so yeah so whoever this person is whoever this two of cups is there's definitely some type of harmony some type of soul connection with this person like i said you know it can be a partner a husband a wife a friend a family member but there's some type of soul connection some type of bond and i feel like the communication is going to flow just like the the water is flowing from this cup but there's some type of brand new beginning between you and this person and it makes you feel just emotionally fulfilled so very beautiful energy what about the eight of cups what are you guys manifesting what are you moving forward with moving forward towards maybe you guys are moving forward to a new a new job you know this the hair front speaks about um a large entity so maybe you're manifesting a new job um a larger company if not this also represents your faith um just a very conventional way of thinking um maybe you're you're moving forward with with this new beginning maybe it's a new way of thinking about your faith you know maybe certain events have transpired in your life and i don't want to say it's made you question your faith um it, it could have strengthening it could have strengthened your faith um but this could be in regards to your faith as well so you know there will be some type of messages coming in with the page of wands this is usually good news too um, typically in regards to some type of new beginning and uh, usually in the workplace but even if it's not in the workplace just know phone calls text messages emails you will be receiving some type of messages in regards to manifesting um, and moving forward with this energy so what about the king of swords clarify the king of swords All right, so King of Swords, we have the Knight of Pentacles. So with the Knights, you know, they bring in change. You know, the Knight of Pentacles, he is the slowest moving um, Knight of them all. However, with the Pentacles, they're very heavy. So there's something that's gonna stand the test of time. They're gonna last, they're gonna, it, this is something for the long run. You know, and maybe this, this King of Swords, you know, this could represent, you know, uh, a authority figure, um, maybe a, a boss or a new manager or supervisor or something of that nature um he makes decisions so maybe he's offering this maybe he's making this decision to offer this uh financial opportunity to you so then you have the three of swords so with this i'm not really getting any heartache i'm getting more of a timekeeper um, especially with the next few weeks so maybe things the ball will get rolling within the next um three days three weeks third time's a charm type situation i'm kind of feeling like more like three weeks with the, within the next few weeks um what about the four of wands what about the stability and the foundation let's see So we have the four of cups 
So you guys literally might just be at home bored, <laughs> discontent, just like, ugh, I am so over this. Because <laughs> you do have a lot of cards of wanting to, to move, move away, at least get the energy moving. And we have that King of Swords again. So, you know, this could be your energy or someone around you, you know, but this guy, he makes a decision. He's very sharp with his tongue. Um, very no nonsense, you know, very no nonsense. I mean, um, clear communication, clear thought. So this is either you or somebody in your life. You know, maybe if maybe you're waiting on this person too, because he looks like he's waiting on something. Maybe you're waiting on this person to make this decision to offer you this this pinnacle. The bottom of the deck, you have the emperor. So just know that you are being guided and supported by the universe. Your guides and angels are working behind the scenes, so you don't have to worry and you don't have to push. Um, you know for that movement it um, it's coming because you guys had nothing but you know forward energy cards as far as moving forward success and things of that nature so thank you so much for watching my video and supporting my channel um, again for the contest make sure you like this video you subscribe and you leave a hashtag below with your sign so hashtag cancer or scorpio or hashtag pisces so I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend and till next time.